Good day, my viewers, and welcome once again to our channel, your channel and my channel. And I say, may the Lord God continue to bless you. If this is your first time of stumbling into this channel or coming to this channel, welcome to the family. I give you a welcome greeting with a thumb up. And I say, may the good Lord bless you. And may this channel be a blessing indeed in your life and your entire family. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. To my uh, returning subscribers, mm -mm, it's always a double for you. Thank you for being there for me. I won't take your love for granted. All your contributions to the growth of this uh, channel, sharing my videos, writing comments, encouraging me in different ways. I am grateful. Thank you, my God, whom I serve. He that is, that was, and that is to come. The Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the God of heaven and earth, may he in return bless you and the works of your hands indeed. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Today, okay, before I go ahead, today we are going to be talking on a topic I titled, How to Banish and Cleanse Your Place with Coconut and Cascarilla. Some people will say, which one is Cascarilla again? Cascarilla, Cascarilla is the shell of the egg, is the egg shell. Mm -hmm. So many people never knew that the egg shell that we threw around and waste after using the egg, the egg content inside is a spiritual uh, material you can use for spiritual cleansing, actually. Yes. Don't worry, I'm going to tell you how to use the cascarilla, the eggshell, in conjunction or in collaboration with a coconut to cleanse your house of negative vibes, negative energies. It's a known fact that always, every time, people's dwelling places are being contaminated. You have visitors that visit your house. You buy things from outside and bring inside your house. You buy new clothes. Several hands have touched those things you are buying. And they have contacted negative energies in the course of hand-to-hand -hand transfer. Yes, so many people with different vibes and different energies. They come visiting you in your house, in your offices. You enter inside the buses, public buses, public trains. You meet with different kinds of people. You touch the chair, the seat of the chair, the train and the airplane. And you contact so many different negative energies. Which, if you do not cleanse yourself of those, if you do not clean your, your, your space of those, it blocks the flow of blessing. The pace of your prosperity is always attacked. It reduces, it reduces it. And so you need to regularly cleanse it there is a saying that says i have said that adage once i think there are different roads that lead to the market so cleansing can be done in different manners in different ways you can even also use this method to cleanse yourself too of negative vibes and energies however before we proceed don't touch that dial. To my first time channel visitors, do not forget to subscribe to my channel with immediate effect, not by command, but not beg. Please subscribe to my channel. Look at the red button by the right hand of this video down below. You will see a red button there. Click on it and put the notification bell to all so that whenever I upload a new video, you will be notified. God bless you as you do so. So, how do we do this? Because I want to be as brief as brief itself. Mm -hmm. I'm in a hurry to go to somewhere. So, I had to do this. Mm, because of my family out there. When I say my family, I'm talking about you. Yes. Don't forget to like my videos, share it, and write your comments. Now, when you get your egg, after using the egg, wash it, the shell, after you've removed the egg content, wash the egg shell, clean, and dry it. Okay? 
when you have dried it, just get enough. And when you have dried them all, grind it. You will grind it. It turns into a white brownish powder. That if you mix the brown eggshell and the white eggshell, it gives you a kind of, it won't be pure white. But if you still had uh, only the white eggs, it will look a bit more uh, whitish than when it's mixed with the brown egg. But it doesn't matter. What you need is the egg shell, which is called a cascarilla. Then you get your coconut. I do not have egg shell here for demonstrational purpose, but you know I have my coconut. So what you do is you get one coconut, you hold it and bless it and consecrate it for that purpose of cleansing and banishment of negative energies. God, I bless this coconut in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I sanctify it and I declare it an instrument of cleansing of negativity, negative energies and evil presence and their banishment from my family, from my house, from my life, from my space. Then after you've done that, you now use this coconut, you roll it over inside the eggshell that you've grounded, the cascarilla, the egg powder, you roll it and let the whole body of the coconut be rolled inside the egg powder, making it now change into white color. Then when you have done that, you drop the coconut on the ground in your apartment. You can start from room to room. Choose room one. You keep it there. You are using your leg to kick the coconut all over in that room like you are playing ball. And as you are doing that, you are saying, God, as I kick this coconut around, every negative energy in this room, I gather them into this coconut. You do that. Every negative vibes, evil presence, I gather them all around. I, 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 I cleanse this apartment. You do it to your room one, your room two, your, your room three, your kitchen, you know, excuse me, your, 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 your sitting room. Every part of your apartment, you clean it up. You are not using ando, you are using leg to kick the uh, coconut all around the room, cleaning all the negative vibes. So once you've done that, you kick it through the exit door, which is the entrance to your apartment. You now kick it out. As I kick it out, I kick out every negative energy that has all ever been in my house. After that, you now go outside. You have kicked it out. You pick it and you go far away from your house. And you say, as I smash this coconut, I send all those energies far away from me and my family. I banish them forever, never to return. That is one way to use the coconut and the cascarilla to cleanse your space. Now, you can use it for yourself, also for your body. The same procedure of, but it, this, you will not use the same coconut that you use for cleaning the ground for your body. Yes, you now get a new coconut, a different coconut. Mix it with the same eggshell powder, then from your head, you now begin to speak and you begin to clean. And you begin to clean whatever energy you want to. You speak your intention and wipe off that poverty, hardship, failure, shame. Wipe off all that nonsense. Go away from your house. Scatter the nonsense. And come back home. Go and get a new, a, a, a cool bucket of water. Add little salt to it and take your bed. And with this, I am telling you, you will feel light. Your your space will become cleansed of all negative energies. You know the the problem. I have with some people is that they will listen to the video quite well, but they will not be patient enough to go and carry out the instructed exercise. But I can tell you, those that are faithful in following this channel are really testifying, and God has been faithful. I am begging you, please, when you watch my video, do as I have taught. And God himself who answers prayers will give you testimony. Like I always tell us, all power belongs to Almighty God. 
So you must put your faith in him, believing in his son, Jesus Christ, and he shall be well with you. Once again, we are coming to an end for today's video. If you have gained or learned anything from this video, like my video, share my video to your groups, your family members, your friends, huh? and write your comment. Till we meet again in my next video, I remain your brother, Pastor Emeka Williams. God bless you.